everybody, it's Bunny, and I'm not sure what my costume is today, but boy, is it horrifying. I am a princess, clown, I've got veins, and I've got guts. <laughs> yeah, yes. Today, we are doing something super fun. We have a mystery. Well, that takes care of the princess part. We have a mystery wig box. A couple of months ago, I did a really fun video that I loved, which was trying on cheap Amazon wigs. I loved doing it. You guys loved watching it. And ever since then, I've been itching. Literally, this wig is very itchy. I'm itching to do something else with wigs. So a very awesome wig hair company. They make a lot of stuff with which having to do with hair, like a lot of hair pieces, wigs. Did I just say the same thing twice? I think so. Anyway, it is a hair and wig company and it is called Insert Name Here. So they offered to send me a big, and I honestly was not expecting this big of a box. I could, um, I could crawl out of this box. Or, or, ooh, ooh, I could do this costume. The Amazon box person. I love boxes. Endless possibilities. So let's just, let's co- Let's just do it. I don't know what, I don't know what's happening. Let's cut it open. That wasn't as impressive as I thought. Let's cut it. Oh, I've done a stab. Also, what do you guys think of the new backdrop? You can't see much of it, but. Oh, spooky. And my shorts are in my butt. Dude, bodysuits are tricky to pee, to live. But I do love this one. It's from uh, the new Black Milk clothing collection. Yes, but I'm still wearing Sophie shorts because I am. Slicing, slicing. Oh, this is a 13 pound, 3.8 ounce box of wigs. How about a sippy sippy first? I feel refreshed. Oh, I should probably read this. Yes. You guys can use the code SWAMPFAM for 15% off. Side wide, side, side wide. Woo. Paper, paper, paper. Also, I should take this off. How about that? Mmm. Ooh, I feel still surprisingly itchy. First things first, I've got a pink bag. Ooh, what am I looking at? Is this a, it's a ponytail. Some of these things we might have to try on last with my natural hair. I put it in a wig cap today because I thought I would be needing that. So I guess, oh my God, I wish you guys could have seen how I just flipped it out of the packaging. Oh, I'm making a mess of this. Yes, oh my God. Look at this little curly piece. Oh my God, the effort. What the frick? I wish you could all touch it at home because it feels so soft. I must warn you guys, my hair does not look good under here. We just got back from Austin and it's been about six ripe days since I've washed my hair last. Oh, what are you? Is this another ponytail? Ooh, this one's named Lily. Why don't I name all of my wigs? That would be so fun. I've never even considered that till now. This one's just Lily. Hi, Lily. You know what? I freaking need two of these so that I can go like that. Yes. <laughs> you know what? I feel like you could get two of these. Maybe they have them in a lighter color and like dye the ends and then you can be Harley Quinn. Now we have three boxes on topsies and I can only imagine that an entire wig is not inside of each of these three boxes. Warranty void if removed. Wow. We're just gonna slice right through these warranties. What do we have in here? Ooh, ooh, oh my God, oh my God, it's a live one. We've got bangs. We've got human bangs. I've been wanting bangs forever, seriously. <gasps> How do I look? I'm clipping this to nothing. Why do I think this is gonna stick? Oh, it smells good. I actually did kind of clip it to the wig cap, so we can just keep going like this. So I think that these are gonna be three little bangs. Oh my God, this isn't a bang, it's a bob. Oh, it's a banging bob. Oh my God, look at, <gasps> do you know what this is? I'm gonna let you guess. It's like a sassy bun, okay? There's a thing, you tighten it on your hair. Can I, oh, why didn't I think of this? Oh, this one's named Sammy. Hi, Sammy. I forgot to look up this one's name, so it's just gonna have to name itself. Woo! Um, this one has a name. Well, this one has a really confusing name. 
I think they need a different name for this one. I can have now two bang, double bang. That's a good look. And you cannot tell me otherwise. Up next, we've got a big old box. Oh, is this gonna be a wig? I love things like this. It makes me feel like I'm opening a magical document. Ooh, la la. What is this one called? This one looks luxurious. So it comes with a sack, a wig cap. Well, this is like instructions. Um, this is a wig cap. Uh, so I'm, I'm guessing this is a wig. What's your name, honey? Ooh, this one's curly. If I was gonna be Dolly Parton working nine to five maybe, um, this would be my co-op. Watch me do this. It's like magic. One, two, three. It looks good. I should have brought a mirror in here so I can see myself. I'm gonna go do that. Give me just one second, okay? I haven't looked in the mirror yet, but I fetched a mirror. Um, ew. Yes. <laughs> I could be a cheerleader now. Will you ask me to prom? Um, this video just got really weird. I should tell you guys, I am highly caffeinated, okay? Because um, I am fresh, I almost said it fresh from the state of Austin, almost. Um, fresh from the city of Austin. And they have a coffee bean and tea leaf there, which I know is not a super exotic vacation destination, but for me it is because they make my favorite iced coffees, but they have so, so many shots of espresso. Well, first of all, they come in a Texas size and that has like 27 shots of espresso and I couldn't help myself. I tried two delicious flavors. So I had dark chocolate, which is my favorite flavor of coffee, but then they had chocolate chip cookie. So do you think I just responsibly drank one coffee or do you think that I uh, ingested eight shots of espresso? Just place your guesses right about now. I feel like I need to like, whoo! I feel like also this wig might fly off at any second because I was cursed with an unusually large head. Okay, so it's pretty difficult to get things to, you know, stick down on top of here, but yes. What do you think of this wig? Yes. Um, oh gosh dang. We have a new pet. Yes. Next wig. Or it might not be a wig. What are you? Wake up in there. What is it? You tell me. You can't see. What is it? Does this one have a name? My baloney has a first name. Wait, does this just say don't care? Oh my God, it says colorful hair. I don't care. I thought the wig was just called don't care and I was like relatable. Oh, oh my God. Is this the I wanna talk to the manager haircut? It's looking like that. I don't know how I ended up on the floor by the way, but here I am. Okay, can I please, could you just, could you get what? Every time I move this thing, oh, it's in a hammock now. Oh, it's just having a luxurious summer day, swinging in a hammock. Could you please cooperate? Thank you so much. We're just all waiting on you, Karen. Oh my God. Wait, is this from a human? It feels distinctively different. Is it humans? I was goofing off till now and then it just got real. Let's put it on and have a little chit chat about it. This wig cap is not um, oh, oh my God, I'm a missing Spice Girl. This wig cap is really, I'll show you guys, okay? Um, normally I just wear really, oh yeah, it's gone, hi. It's out to lunch. I'll show you guys like the back. Like I've got this whole section going on back here. I think people like always ask me how I get a wig cap on and the answer is not very well. I'm about to cut my hair and I do mean really cut it. Right now it's just like out of control long. So I feel like the wigs are delicately, <laughs> this one is like delicately sitting on my head because it like can't fit over the chunk of hair. There we go, is that better? No. <laughs> My head is too big. I feel like that's another reason why generally I always wear wigs with hats because normally everything that's going on up and around here is just a nightmarish mess that I'm trying to conceal. I love this one. I feel like a different person and it's very rare that I see myself with hair that's not at least boob length. So this is like, I feel like I'm having a minute with my red eyebrows, my really poorly done faux veins, and this short wig, yes. 
I feel like this one looks oddly natural. Maybe she's born with it. Next thing, which is another box. So, is it a wig? Any minute, you guys, I'm gonna have, what is it called after you have like a sugar rush, an energy rush, and then a crash? Is there a specific name for that for coffee? Oh, yes. Um, for a very, very short period of my life, I had chestnut brown hair. And for those six months, I felt like a grown, responsible. And then I just dyed my hair back blonde and I'm a baby again. Oh my God, this is like my past life. Okay, because I had chestnut brown hair and bangs. And what is this? Chestnut brown hair bangs. Why am I like putting this on like a baseball cap? I'm sure that's just how all the pros do it. I can't see anything of what's happening. You know what? Now that I'm looking at this under the lights, I don't know that it's chestnut brown. It kind of looks like auburn, which isn't that supposed to be the most beautiful, like considered to be the most beautiful shade of hair? I am... <laughs> Everyone I put on, I'm like, oh my god, this one's my favorite one. Because I really liked the last one too. Yes. But this one just kind of, it's like a whole new me. I'm trying to like curl the bangs a little bit more. I don't know how to bang. Oh my god. Yes, I am a different person. I feel like someone that like studies. I'm studying right now. I'm studying a lot. I don't know what I'm studying. Also, I just heard a very eerie voice out the window. I think I have neighbors. I think people are alive out that way. I think we have one thing left because this is the last box in the box. After I took the last wig off, um, the wig cap is gone too. And then somehow my hair just became unpinned from my head. Hopefully we can just try on the last wig because after that I needed to take off anyway so we can test out the ponytails and the bangs and all of that fun stuff. So time to unbox the last box. Ooh, oh, <gasps> this one is so so pretty. A couple of videos ago, I don't remember which one it was, I told you guys I'm starting to really love the color lavender again. And uh, like when I first started YouTube, I had a really crazy lavender wig. I think I wore it in an outfit of the day like seven or eight years ago. I don't know what happened to that thing, but this really reminds me of that. And I love it. Even though I'm not sure that lavender like looks the best on me for whatever reason. Maybe it's because I have like blue eyes. So I think like purple hair and blue eyes like doesn't, I don't know, look good on me uh, personally. I feel like kind of the color of my eyes is what always stops me from dyeing my hair a fun color because I really do love the look of it and it is always so tempting. I think if I personally was gonna pick a color, well, okay, besides like gray or silver, because I love that, uh, but if I was gonna pick like a super vibrant color, I think I would go with blue, but I think blue hair with blue eyes would be just like way too much uh, for me personally, but I'm sure lots of people in the world have blue hair and blue eyes, and I'm sure it does look lovely, but for some reason I'm just like, I don't know. Oh, this one is like a lace lace front or it doesn't have the lace trimmed yet. So that is going to be fun to do. But you guys, I really actually like this color. I can't tell if I have it sitting on my head well anymore because the wig cap is gone. I really do love the look of this. What do you guys think? Do you like it better when wigs like have some styling to it, like a little bit um, curly or... I was gonna say crimped, like no service in the world has probably ever made a crimped wig. Do you guys like when wigs have a little bit of curl to them or do you think that that makes them look a little less natural? I shouldn't even show you guys the back cause you're just gonna see my crazy <laughs> scraggly ponytail. I don't know. Um, I really, really like this one. I'm not sure which wig is my favorite. I really love this one cause I feel like it gives me a whole different look, like very different than what I look like every day. But I do also love this one and this one. These three are kind of my favorites. Let's try on the bangs first, just cause I feel like this style that I have going on right now. Oh my God, totally different color. 
than my natural hair. I've wanted bangs for a really long time and I keep talking about it on Twitter and stuff and everybody's like, don't do it, you're gonna regret it immediately. Maybe if I get further away from the camera, does that blend a little bit better? I'm gonna go ahead and snap this black one over it. It's actually not black, I don't think. I think it's like a natural dark brown. I went into the bathroom and I consulted the large mirror and I tried to kind of like style them a little bit more and honestly I think it's really cute. I think the only thing that's throwing me off a little bit is the color matching. Definitely you would probably have an easier time matching yourself if you didn't have like four different colors of hair on your head. Like I almost think if I had like a headband on or something and spent a little bit more time styling them that it could really look very, 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 very cute. I just unclipped just the top one and now I look like Tinkerbell. Like if Tinkerbell got into some sort of scuffle on the playground. Let's go ahead and try and do this sassy bun. I'm honestly so excited about this. So right now I'm untying this little thing here so that I can make this bigger. <laughs> Hopefully you guys can just see what I'm doing because like literally there's no words of explanation here. We're just gonna put it on top of my sassy bun and hopefully that's what I'm supposed to do with it. You know what, I'm gonna go consult Bigger Mirror over there. Two quick things about this. I like it, but also I feel like if I do end up cutting my hair a lot shorter, this would be something that I would potentially get a lot more use out of. It's harder for me to use because literally right now my hair, if it's not like pulled back or down or anything, pulled up, pulled down, it's not pulled down. It's practically to the length of my butt when I stand up. So it's just a lot, like I tried to wrap my uh, bun in a neater way so that I could use this as a topper and like really scrunch all my natural hair underneath there. But I still don't think I have it on situated like 100% perfectly, but it does add like a lot of volume to your bun if you don't have a lot of voluminous hair. Literally never had a pony in my life. Oh my god, there's like velcro. <gasps> Am I supposed to put my hair in the middle or this thing in the middle? I probably should have watched like a tutorial, but you guys know me. I just like to figure stuff out. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, moment of honesty. I literally thought that I would hate these clip-in ponytails. Like I thought that they would just look really silly on me, especially since I do already have such long hair. I kind of thought it was just like if you really just wanted to do like the whole Ari Ari Ariana, I'm never gonna say that name right, Ari Ariana Grande. If you wanted to look like that, I kind of thought that that is like the target audience for these like super long clip-in ponytails. But honestly, there's so much hair here. I feel like this color really does blend in with my natural hair color really well. It's definitely going to take a little bit of a learning curve. I feel like that's the same with the bangs. Like I feel like these hair pieces are a lot. It's gonna look more natural and it's gonna look better if you take some time, play around with it, figure out like what look suits you best. You know, I feel like a wig is kind of easier to wear because you just put on a wig cap and you can even like put on a hat or something and then you don't even really have to worry about the hairline blending in, stuff like that. But these hair pieces, like since you're combining it and styling it with your own natural hair, I just feel like it takes, you know, it's like learning any new kind of hairstyle, but there is so much hair here. It just really like, even if you're somebody like me and you do already have really long hair, this is just gonna add a lot of volume to your hair because that is one reason why I am really wanting to cut my hair lately is because I feel like it's really long but I feel like it is kind of diminishing some of the volume which is sad. Like I really want to do like an Amy Winehouse kind of hairstyle with this and I feel like it gives you so much hair to play with. So right now it is kind of pulling because I just don't have it clipped in very well and you can definitely see like where the hair is clipped in. But I, I don't know you guys, I'm kind of crazy about it and I'm looking forward to styling it 
more. I'm not sure if I'm going to like this one as much. I don't know if I said that somewhere else in this video. Also, my ponytail is a mess. <laughs> my own. See, I was gonna try and like use this hair in the front and like wrap around and hide the band. I don't know if I said this earlier in the video or not, um, but I do kind of like when wigs and hair pieces are more on the straight side than the pre-curled side because then I feel like to blend them in like I am gonna have to go through and curl my natural hair as well. I'm just holding this one in at this point because my hair is just a nightmarish situation. Anyway you guys I hope y'all had as much fun as I did. Thank you guys so so much for hanging out today and for watching and thank you so much once again to insert name here for sending this gigantic wig mystery box. Let me know if you guys would like to see more wig videos this vlogoween Halloween season or just in general on my channel. I love you guys so so much and I will see y'all again tomorrow because it's vlogoween and we're here every day. I'm so excited. Okay I'll see you guys tomorrow. Until then have a good night, have a good sleep, have a good dinner, whatever you might be doing. I love you guys so much and I'll see you later. Bye!